Today we're here at the Edgewood Children's Ranch helping them harvest some of the produce we've been growing for them. The Edgewood Children's Ranch is a nonprofit organization that houses anywhere from 50 to 60 children, both male and female, ages 6 or 7 to around 17 or 18. And we've been working in conjunction with them on this project since the fall semester of 2013. I've had students volunteer over here and also students get elective credit toward their AS degree in the form of independent studies. Discipline of horticulture and agriculture is the hands-on learning aspect of it. There's no way around it. And what better laboratory for our students than an actual small farm, a farm that where they could learn different methods of production, proper irrigation and fertilization practices. This farm is located just two miles or so from the West Campus. It's a perfect location in the middle of Metro West, a busy area in Orlando, and we're able to show people what goes into growing food. When we started in January, there was nothing out here. Uh, we helped to build the beds and lay the seeds, so the seeds, transplant some transplants. Students also now get an idea of possible career opportunities. When I walked into Dr. Garza's office, I didn't know anything. A year and a half later, I own my own greenhouse business. I volunteer. I've come a long way. One of the goals was to educate the children here on where their food comes from. Most kids nowadays have no idea. They think it comes from the back of the supermarket. The kids here have been helping us plant, helping us harvest. I like planting um, the fruit and vegetables. My favorite crops would be the corn. They teach us how we could survive without all these fast food places. Half these plants I never knew existed. The food tastes much better than I thought. The kids come to us from a wide range of background. Some of them are struggling in school. Some of them are having trouble at home. And our goal is to hopefully reestablish the family to where the kid gets to go back home into a different environment where things are better than what they were when they came here. I've learned to work together with my fellow classmates. Like I need them for teamwork because there's no I in teamwork. People who come here as a bad situation, but this place helps motivate you with people that actually care for you and they want you to succeed. And it's really good to learn about nature and how it works. It's given opportunity that our kids can see that their education can continue. Most of our kids don't even consider the fact of college is even a possibility. But when they see some of the students here working and they're here in their backgrounds and what they're doing, our kids are able to see that, hey, this might be something I can do later on. So it's opening up their eyes to opportunities out there. The most rewarding aspect of this for me personally has been to see the interaction between the Valencia students and the children here at the ranch. To see learning going on from both of these groups in conjunction and to have our Valencia students help teach some of the kids here at the ranch. And that's just been a phenomenal part of this project.